Hi, I'm Ron. Are you one of those people wondering where the Iloilo city came from? Now, in this video, I will tell you the history of Iloilo city. Iloilo takes its name from Irong Irong, the old name of the city of Iloilo. A thong of land that sticks out like a nose on the south of Iloilo River. The Maragtas legend tells the story of Iloilo way back in the 13th century when Dato Puti and his fellow Datos fled from the tyranny of Sultan Makatunao of Borneo and landed at the mouth of the Siwaragan River now known as the town of San Joaquin and eventually settled there. At that time, people called the Ati who were ruled by King Marikudo and Queen Maniwang Tiwa inhabited Panay. King Marikudo bartered the lowlands of Panay Island for a golden hat, sadu, and a long gold necklace, manangyan, and other assorted gifts to the Burnean Datus. The latter then took complete control of the island with the Ati. Retiring to the mountains, it was Datu Paiburong who was assigned in Irong Iro. Panay Island was ruled under the code of Galantia, where peace and prosperity reigned. But this was disrupted when the Spaniards came and established the provincial government. As early as 1855, Iloilo opened to the world of trade and became the biggest port in the and premier province of the country because of the various economic activities. Municipio de Iloilo became under the Bakura law in When the Philippine Revolution started, Panay uprising against the Spaniards was led by General Martin Delgado of Santa Barbara, who liberated all the towns except Molo and Haro. December 28, 1898, marked the arrival of the Americans at the Iloilo port. And on April 11, 1901, Iloilo City, whose status has reverted to municipality, became the chief port and trading center of Panay and Neko. Because it progressed steadily, the Commonwealth Act Number no. 158 incorporated the surrounding towns of La Paz, Haro, Mandarillao, and Arevalo to form Iloilo City, and was finally inaugurated on August 25, 1937, and was dubbed as the Queen City of the South. General Martin Delgado became the first governor of the province of Iloilo. The Japanese occupation started on April 16, 1942. The Panay Guerrilla Movement, the first resistance group in the Philippines, continued fighting the Japanese Imperial Army even before the American liberation of Panay on July 4, 1946. The province of Iloilo occupies the southern and northern eastern portion of Panay Island. Its boundaries are the province of Capiz and Hintotolo Channel in the north, the Timora Strait in the south, the Panay Gulf and Iloilo Strait in the east, and the province of Antique in the west. 